Hey there, I wanted to uh, document what I'm working on here and uh, just let you guys in on uh, what's happening. I am trying some hydro abrasion, also known as shellac resist. And um, this is actually pretty exciting. Um, uh, you guys uh, may have heard of shellac. That is uh, something you find in the paint section of the hardware store. And it's a uh, product that's made, uh, I think, from some sort of secretions from some beetle or something. Anyway, anyway, shellac, right? You got it. Okay, so what I'm doing, I'm using the shellac as a resist. And so I'm painting it on the areas here that I've, um, where I want the white slip to remain. And so I've drawn out my pattern here. I'm putting the shellac on and then what I'll do is I can use a sponge and some a damp sponge to wipe away this area in the background where I don't want the slip anymore. You guys know my pots um, usually have some contrast between the white slip and then I usually scratch this away and I've been trying to figure out how to um, work with less dust in the studio and so this may be a pretty cool solution check this out so I'll just continue to wipe this clean out the sponge and the shellac is tough and it protects the area there underneath or with the white slip underneath it and actually uh, uh, you get a little raised edge here too because the shellac is tough and it's and it's as you wipe this you get a nice little edge there and so then I'll come back and clean up with a nice clean sponge all that sort of messy bit there but I've already done quite a few pots here I've got this picture finished and uh, a cup and um, something else over there. So anyway, um, it's pretty cool. I'm kind of excited about it. And I'll just uh, keep working. I'm going to keep working on this dish here and um, let you know how it turns out. Alright, see ya. Alright, I realize that last clip was a little spastic so uh, anyway. Sorry about that. I'm gonna, I've am gonna. i got all this shellac and it's dried for about half an hour. So I'm going to go ahead and start wiping some of this away. And you can see, again, how this works. And what's sort of nice is that, um, you know, if I... Uh, if I want to see, like I've got a little extra uh, right there shellac that may not have been where I wanted, but I can I can still scrape that away with just a uh, with a, my knife or something. Uh -oh, whole thing's shaking. So this is pretty cool, and it's just wonderful that there's no dust. I can't tell you how I'm ex how excited I am that there's no dust. Now of course I've got to fire these and, and that will be the 